Good afternoon, Eagles. I'm Christian Peppel. And I'm Jacob Hammerschmidt. Here are your afternoon announcements. Lorain County Metro Parks is excited to announce registration for the 2020 Spirit of America Lorain Boating Education Camp. This free summer camp is open to all Lorain County students aged 12 to 15 years, providing hands-on skill development in sailing, power boating, kayaking, canoeing, stand-up paddleboarding, and a large vessel experience. Prior to the on-water boating camp, participants will earn an Ohio Boating Education Certificate, a lifetime boating license. Info is available at the Spirit of America webpage. The link is on the Avon High School announcement website. Application forms are in the administrative office. Completed applications and essays can be submitted to apotonic at rainecountymetroparks.com until April 1st. Student Council will be working with the American Red Cross to host a blood drive at AHS that will take place on Wednesday, February 5th in the Auxiliary Gym. To sign up to donate, visit the Student Council table in the Commons during lunch now through Tuesday, February 4th. You should sign up to donate blood during release or study hall. Permission is needed from your teacher if you will miss class to donate blood. Students who are 16 will need to obtain parental permission to donate. Students who are 17 or older do not need parental permission. Please consider donating blood. If you can, each donation can save three lives. This week, the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society will be selling t-shirts and raffle tickets at lunch. With the purchase of a t-shirt, you get one raffle ticket and free admission to the girls' basketball senior night. Raffle tickets can be placed in buckets to win Indians tickets or a closed parking spot. Each shirt is $10 and each ticket is $1. Attention students of Avon, the class of 2023 is holding a Dine to Note event this Thursday, January 30th at Panda Express. To contribute, simply snap a pic of one of the Panda Express flyers located around the school and show the cashier at checkout. 20% of the proceeds earned will benefit the freshman class. Please show your support with some delicious Chinese takeout. Attention freshmen, sophomores, and juniors. The deadline to submit next school year's class schedule in Power School is Friday, February 7th. This is also the deadline to turn in your AP endorsement form. If you have any questions, please contact your counselor or visit Student Services. Now we're going to send it over to take a look at some of the new classes. Hi, I'm Mr. Moisenko. Uh, I teach men's chorus, women's chorus, and chorale. Okay, so we have uh, men's chorus to start with. Men's chorus is uh, kind of the introductory level for anybody who just wants to sing. We've got a great time. It's a smaller group right now, but any guy in the school who's interested in uh, being part of a choir, we have to take our ex extracurriculars anyway, our arts credit. Men's Chorus is a great place to start. We sing a lot of fun music, uh, a couple concerts a year. It's a great time. It's a great place if you are wanting to learn more about music or just need your credit. It's a great place to kind of get involved, meet some new people, and Men's Chorus is a great place for that. We have Women's Chorus as well, um, and Women's Chorus is similar. Um, most people start in Women's Chorus, freshman through senior. We've got them in the group. It's a larger group. Um, we go to contest, large group contest with Women's Chorus, um, which is a great chance to kind of test out the skills, um, there's a lot of interesting music working on lots of different languages and those sorts of things, but Women's Chorus is a great place also. And then we have Chorale, which is a select group at the top of the pyramid. Um, it's going to be, it's a smaller group, um, and it's really for those students who have a lot of desire and a lot of musical skill and are really pushing to expand what they are able to do. We sing in a lot of different languages as well. Um, contest for them. Um, the last couple of years we've gone to state contest and performed very well. Um, so across the board, the music groups have a lot to offer, um, opportunities for solos and languages, um, different cultures, and it's just an opportunity to you know, sing and enjoy you know, uh, being together and having something musical to talk about. And then the final class I teach is broadcast journalism, which is my most advanced students. Um, they are the students that have a bulk of the like, really major production responsibilities placed on them. Uh, not only do we do the daily announcements and you know inform students that way, but broadcast journalism is really a news-oriented class where we are um, sharing, highlighting, and presenting information to our audience. The thing that makes these classes different 
students have the opportunity to create things that will be shared with Avon High School and the Avon community. I can share with pretty much all the students at Avon High School. Along with my media-based classes, I've also started teaching Introduction to Web Design. Um, that's a class where students learn how to create a website from scratch. We do a lot of coding. It's HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. Um, so things that are you know, can be applied in the real world for, you know, careers and jobs and things like that. We just begin to kind of scratch the surface of, of web design. The other technology class that I teach is Introduction to Animation. And in that class we learn everything from um, creating banners and designs to animating uh, characters and figures. We learn walk cycles, face rigging, um, you know, we also go back and look at the history of animation and how animated film came to be where it's at today. So a really fun class. Both classes are very hands-on. Um, students are in a lab environment. Um, and then ultimately, our goal is to publish them and share them with a wider audience. That's all we have for you today, Eagles. I'm Christian Peppel. And I'm Jacob Hammerschmidt. Have an amazing day.